Hi, this is Matt, and this is a video on how to get a LinkedIn API key. So I'm right here on my LinkedIn account, uh, Matt Crawford. Uh, give me a follow if you're not already. And if you want to actually create a uh, an app, get an API key, uh, you need to come over to this one. So uh, I've got LinkedIn. And so if you want a LinkedIn API key for any purpose, any kind of app that you're creating um, or any integration that you need anywhere, you need to first of all create an app through the LinkedIn developer portal. So the LinkedIn developer portal is right here at linkedin.com slash developers. I'll put the URL in the uh, in the description just below this video. But what you want to do is you want to create an app. So you need to put an app name in here. Uh, then you're going to actually link this to uh, a LinkedIn page. So um, if I was to do mine, I might go with um, Filmmaking Lifestyle, one of my companies. So I could link here, Filmmaking Lifestyle Media. Uh, and you're just going to link it up to your own page here, your own company page or URL. And so then we can also add a privacy policy here, um, a URL to your actual privacy policy for the app. This is optional. And then you can add a logo. So you can click there and upload uh, a small logo. Uh, it needs to be at least 100 PX. You can actually upload that from your computer. And then once you've added all of this, you need to sign a legal agreement and actually say that you are going to abide by the terms of service. And then once you've entered all of that data, you click create app. So here's one that I created earlier. I've got the Matt app right here. I've got a little logo there, which you actually have to enter. That's not optional, weirdly. Uh, so they, they do require that you have a logo. Uh, so that's fine, that's cool. And yeah, so to actually get your API key, so once you've created your app, just gonna close that here. Got some of the details here in settings. And so we need to go over to auth and we'll find here we've got the client ID and the primary secret, uh, the primary client secret. So this is essentially the API key. We can actually generate a new one here. I will of course delete uh, this one straight afterwards as this is just for demo purposes. But in order to actually get your, so whether you need the primary client secret or this one here, the client ID is essentially the API key. You can actually copy both of these. So you can copy and paste that one or you can get, click here to actually copy that to the dashboard. And so that is how you actually get a LinkedIn API key. So hopefully this video on how to get your LinkedIn API key has been useful. Uh, I've shown you how to actually create the app. I've shown you the all section and where to actually get the API key. And hopefully you found this video really helpful.